Hello everybody, it's me Nate, aka Devil Dog, and I'm back with another episode of Nate Tries. This time I'm trying a mystery Mountain Dew drink. That's right, just like what the title said, but what is it? Is it super rare or what? Well, this is a very specific Mountain Dew you can only get for a limited time only at the local Speedway gas stations. It is known as Mountain Dew Spark. As you can see here, Mountain Dew Spark. It looks like cotton candy, and it is supposed to be Mountain Dew with a blast of raspberry lemonade. Raspberry lemonade Mountain Dew. Now, I'm going to go ahead and crack this thing open and see if it actually does taste like raspberry lemonade Mountain Dew. That's kind of redundant considering that Mountain Dew is a citrus soda to begin with. Uh, but uh, I don't understand why they got a picture of a NASCAR on there, you know, Spark. But uh, let's go ahead and open up this limited edition, limited to as many as they can friggin' sell, um, a Mountain Dew Spark. Okay, it smells like Code Red. It's got like a Code Red smell. Well, cheers, everybody. Yeah. I do get the lemonade. You get a Mountain Dew flavor, as usual, because it's Mountain Dew. Why wouldn't you? Uh, you get the Mountain Dew flavor, and you do get the lemonade flavor. But I am not getting any raspberry. That might just be my palate, but... I'm not getting the raspberry. Like I said, I get the Mountain Dew and I get the lemonade. I do get a lemonade flavor. I don't think this has enough, enough raspberry in it to really the warrant of raspberry. It might just be me. If you try this drink, you may find it to be very raspberry forward in terms of flavor because everyone's flavor palette is different. I'd like to think that mine's a little, uh, you know, robust from all the things that I've ingested over the years. Um, but honestly, I do get the Mountain Dew flavor and I do get the, uh, the, the, the lemonade. I do get that, but I don't get any bit of ras no raspberry at all. Hmm. No. Oh. It's actually pretty good, though. Unlike some of their other flavors, I will say that this one actually does taste good. And when it's super hot and it's ice cold, this actually is quite refreshing. It really is quite good. It, But to me, it tastes like lemonade with a hint of Mountain Dew. I'm um, not getting any raspberry. Um, I, I mean, I think, you know, other than the color that you get, no, I am not getting any raspberry in this. Mm. But, if you, um, I don't know if it's going to be anywhere, because I'm in Ohio. Um, I'm sure there's Speedway's other places other than Ohio. Uh, but uh, go to your local Speedway, if you have one, and see if you can pick yourself up a Mountain Dew Spark today. And if you have had this, uh, leave in the comments below what you taste, if you taste a raspberry or not. I really do not. I do get the lemonade flavor with the Mountain Dew immediately, and I do get that, and it is a good flavor. And honestly, for a... Um, you know, gimmicky soda. This one's actually not that bad. It's tasty. It's pretty dang tasty because who doesn't like an ice cold lemonade on a hot summer's day or a hot fall's day or a hot winter's day with the way this world's been going around. Uh, but nonetheless, let me know in the comments below what you think about Mountain Dew Spark. 
Have you had this? Is this in your location? Are there any other weird flavor Mountain Dews that you have in your area that I don't have around here? Let me know in the comments below. Make sure to hit the like button if you like this video. Hit the subscribe button to subscribe to my channel. Make sure to hit the bell icon so you stay updated whenever I release any new videos. And I always end my videos by saying, have fun, play hard, and remember people. The devil's in the details. And I do not get raspberry in this. Oh well. Peace out. Hello, Devil Dog Gaming. It is I, David Faustino, better known as Bud Bundy. Yes, Devil Dog Gaming, it is I, the Grand Master, the Grand Flasher, the Cross Dresser, the Godmother, the God father the gas passer i think you get the point devil dog gaming more important nate wanted me to reach out he wanted me to dig deep and roast the hell out of his youtube channel but what's so funny is i'm gonna roast the hell out of you nate because the cameo gods don't provide a link so i can't even watch your damn your damn youtube channel so i'm gonna roast you next time get it right send the link figure it out there nate anyway uh, can't wait to uh, check out Devil Dog Gaming once you actually can figure out how to provide me a link there, Nate. Uh, anyway, Bud Bundy signing off here. Grandmaster B, the Grand Flasher. Uh, and I wanted to let, always, as always, if they say at Devil Dog Gaming, the devil's in the details. Whoa, Bundy. Peace out, y'all. Well, Nathan, I just want to make it clear once and for all, in case you didn't know, the devil's in the details. And uh, idle hands are the devil's workshop. So make of that what you will. This is Clementine, and the devil's in the details. What up? It's Bam Margera giving a shout out to Devil Dog Gaming, and the devil's in the details. Nate! Discord here. I don't know where you are, but I'm in Los Angeles, and I think you can see it in the background on a beautiful day. So when are we all going to get back together again? Who's to say? The devil is in the details. The devil is in the details. <laughs> yes, the devil is in the details. Wouldn't you say?